Wyatt. I think when we talked to Logan the day of his 21st birthday, he was talking about getting on a plane, flying to Colorado. You're about to get on a plane to fly back to Dallas to celebrate yours. When you look at just what you've done before turning 21, and did you imagine being in this spot, and how do you sum up what tonight meant for you? Yeah, um, it's been a it's been a crazy uh, crazy couple of the years. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't think if you were you know tell me I'd you know be in the position you know playing in you know the NHL playoffs for for the Stars. If you were to tell me that, um, you know, I guess when was that 2020 in COVID? Um, yeah, I mean, I don't know if I'd believe you. So I mean, it's been a pretty cool couple of years, and uh, I'm just you know really thankful and um, you know just so happy to have met some you know amazing people along the way and. Um, you know, just have a chance to, you know, be with the stars and um, just kind of being around some, some amazing people. And, sorry, I'll do one more. Um, and for both of you guys, just being in this position now, having a chance to close this out at home, can you just describe the confidence in the room right now and how it feels to be in this spot? Um, yeah, I mean, we're, um, you know, after losing, losing game one, um, you know we're in the you know best spot we could we could be winning three straight so um yeah i mean we know they're going to they're going to come out really hard next game and um yeah i mean i think it's so important to you know be able to close it out uh, hey Wyatt, Jeff from Fox Dallas. Uh, obviously these types of facts aren't what you're focused on but uh, you're the only other player the only other guy who's ever had a shorthanded goal and a power play goal younger than 21 in a playoff game is Wayne Gretzky. How does that hit you? Um it's cool. Um, yeah, I mean, yeah, it's it's cool. I'm, I mean, I'm just trying to do my part and and helping chip in whatever whatever that may be. Um, yeah. Hey, Jason. Uh, there's a lot going on in the for their lineup before the game. One, are you aware of that? And then two, it just seems like you guys had a lot of intention in in that start because you you wanted to take over the game right from the start. It seemed like. Yeah, I mean, it's the Stanley Cup playoffs. I mean, stuff happens. Lineup changes. Um, doesn't change our preparation or anything. We want to get on a good start. I think our first period might have been the be best first period of the series. And, uh, I mean, we wanted to set the tone and try to build on that uh, going into the second and third periods. And, uh, um, what do you think of Wyatt's play? Obviously, poking the puck away from a car, it's just a... Fantastic play at the right time. Yeah, I mean, credit our penalty killers, doing a really good job. Um, yeah, it's a very confident play by him. Um, then try to take advantage of it, try to produce, I mean, offense when he can. Um, I mean, that Wayne Gretzky said it's pretty neat. Um, yeah, I don't, you don't see many uh, guys under 21 kill penalties in itself. Surely not out there scoring on the power play too, so obviously it's a tremendous achievement. Um, and it just shows how how well and how prepared and how hard he's come. And I mean, it's only gonna keep going up from here. Right. You guys, you've led in every game in this series. You held the Avalanche. You outshot them fourteen to two in the first period. Can you just talk about what's going into these these efforts from you guys? Yeah, I mean, it's uh, we know they're they're a fast team. We know what we have to do. Um, Everyone in our, in our dressing room knows how to play the right way. And the right way is successful for us these whole playoffs. And that's all the little details, getting above, forechecking good spots, good routes. And I think it's just contagious in that in our, in our, on our bench. I think one guy sees it, another guy sees it, and you just get rolling and rolling. And it's great to see that... Uh, like I said, that how contagious it is when we do everything the right way. And, I mean, good things happen.